Hi everybody, Andy here with eTrailer.com. Let's take a look together at this Shocker Hitch Quick Air Fifth Wheel Pin Box. This is going to upgrade your existing pin box on your fifth wheel trailer, and this king pin will still insert into your truck's fifth wheel hitch. And this quick air will drastically reduce chucking and absorb road shock and minimize bounce, helping to improve the ride and reduce the wear and tear on your truck and on your fifth wheel camper trailer. Now this is designed specifically to replace your Lippert 1621, 0719 and Rhino pin boxes. So if you have either one of those, then this is going to fit right in place with your original hardware. Now insulation is going to be relatively simple. However, this pin box is heavy. I needed uh, my coworker here to help me put it on my table. So uh, you will definitely need a second set of hands to help you lower down your original pin box and to lift this one into place when you're installing it. So you do wanna make sure that you have plenty of support. This is made here in the USA, in Jamestown, North Dakota, actually, of a sturdy steel construction. And the powder coat finish is going to do a great job of helping this to resist rust and corrosion. This does have a towing capacity of 24,000 pounds and a pin weight capacity of 6,000 pounds. And the built-in shock absorption is achieved by using an inflatable airbag, and that's gonna be kind of difficult for you to see because the airbag is uh, behind this, this, um, this panel here. But we do have uh, an airbag there, and then we also have Shocker's signature um, shock absorbing bump stops there uh, at the top. So the advantage that the airbag is going to give you is the ability to adjust the air pressure for the best ride and load control. There is an air valve at the bottom, and uh, it's right here. And again, you're not gonna be able to see that, but I do like that the, out, the air valve is down here because that's gonna make it very easy um, to uh, get a, um, an air uh, chuck up there to uh, quickly and easily adjust the air pressure. So you're gonna be able to easily adjust this airbag to give you that ride that you're looking for. And initially, you want to set the air pressure to about 15 PSI and then test drive and then just adjust the pressure in five uh, PSI increments until you find that sweet spot. The typical sweet spot, um, the typical pressure rather that you're going to want is about uh, 15 to 25 PSI. Uh, it will be somewhat dependent on the weight of your trailer. So heavier trailers may take more air than lighter trailers. So just play with that a little bit until you find that, uh, that ride that you are looking for. You do wanna make sure that you don't exceed 100 PSI or you will damage that bag. Looking here at the front, we do have a grease Zerk fitting uh, down in here that's going to make maintenance uh, very easy. So if you are looking to replace um, or upgrade rather your Lippert 1621, 0719 or Rhino pin box with a shock absorbing uh, pin box, this is really going to be a great option for you to consider. Instructions are also going to be included to guide you through that insulation process. And I think that's gonna wrap up our look today. I do hope that our time together has been helpful for you. Again, my name is Andy. Thank you for joining me.